Hello, Recorder Gamers, and welcome to the other side of the Recorder Arcade. So, a few of my fans have wanted to know, what is the process of actually putting one of these videos together? Uh, making all the recordings, putting this me here, this me here, this me here, layering everything, doing green screening, how do I get the music? Where does it all happen? How does it all go along? So, I thought I would show you some backstage view of what I do to make the videos that you see me put out on YouTube on the Recorder Arcade. So first things first is we've got to pick a song. Uh, this song in particular is a lot of fun. Uh, it is the song Atlantis from the game Banjo-Kazooie. Uh, well, actually the sequel to Banjo-Kazooie, Banjo-Tooie composed by Grant Kirkhope, um, who actually suggested that I do this song for the Recorder Arcade. So here's to you, Grant. Um, and I'm going to show you everything I do to make this video come to life. So first things first, got to have all of the essentials ready for arranging. So obviously I've got my piano here. I've got a sheet of electric sheet music. I don't like paper. I like to keep everything nice and tidy that way. Um, I've got a clock so I can keep track of how long I'm going so I don't compose into the wee hours of the night until I can't keep my eyes open anymore, even though I easily could do that. Um, I've got the speaker for the music that I'm going to be listening to to write down what I've got. Um, I'm going to be pulling up the song on YouTube. Uh, thanks, YouTube. Um, so I can listen to it and figure out all the notes and all the music on the piano and write them down on my sheet music. A couple extra things I have around. I've got, you know, big bottle of water. I got some uh, chocolate to snack on and I've got a bunch of toys, which I am sure we will uh, end up using at some point tonight because sometimes you just start losing your mind and you need to distract yourself. So. Uh, with all that being said, here we go into Atlantis from Banjo-Tooie. I've already familiarized myself with this piece a little bit, but I only had a Nintendo growing up, so I got to watch my friend play Banjo-Kazooie, and I never really got to play Banjo-Tooie at all, which is a shame because I really want to, and I probably should now that I'm an adult. Uh, but I have familiarized myself with the piece a little bit uh, to get used to it, have an idea of where I want to go, how soft and how loud and how many instruments I want to use, just very, very roughly, but I'm still pretty unfamiliar with it. So we're going to pull it up on YouTube, and we're just going to give it a quick listen and dive right into figuring out the music. Sounds like we're in... C major, which is pretty common key for yep, C major. Okay, so we're going to do that. Grab my pencil here. So we're in C major, and let's try and figure out this first little lick here. See what we can do. So knowing we're in C. It's a very repetitive process. I get to listen to about four to five seconds of music, try and figure it out, put it back together, and then listen to it again, get a little bit more, and then listen to it again. So that's a lot of what I get to do here. So we will Let's 
listen to it again. Why not? Because we have to. Yay! That's a glissando more or less. Probably less. had a really awesome idea so we're gonna try something out here we're gonna have a little fun I said we had a lot of glissandos didn't I let's see what we can do with a slide whistle why not let's have some fun It's very repetitive sometimes, but that's what makes it so beautiful and charming to listen to in the background of your action-based video game. We'll just listen for a little bit, because it's pretty. Alright, yeah, and then back to C. Alright, it's a pretty standard C to A flat chord progression, a major one to a flat six mediant nerd. <laughs> That is what this gorgeous piece looks like. Isn't this fantastic? This is what music is all about, folks. Right here. This ridiculous gibberish that I have on this iPad. <laughs> Life-giving water, nectar of the gods, Graham can now feel strength and renewal flowing through him. check here we are about a minute we've got about a minute and 30 seconds of this song roughly written down and we've been going for a, just under 45 minutes so that's that's pretty good timing So that was the first step of just transcribing the music from the original video game score. So all I had is the music to listen to, the piano to play on, and some music sheet to write it down on. That's all I had, that's all I get to work with. So there's step one. So next step is going to be we're going to hop on the computer and we are going to start orchestrating. This. I hope you enjoyed this first backstage glimpse of the Recorder Arcade and everything that goes on behind the scenes. So keep watching. Don't forget to uh, leave me your comments below. Tell me what you think of the first step of the Recorder Arcade process. And as always, on your way down there, hit that red subscribe button and the notification bell. And don't forget to share this channel with all your friends and spread the video game and the Recorder love. And we'll see you next time to get ready to play.